to Martin Says. Today, I'll be sharing with you my five thoughts on why you should get a pair of van slip-ons. Let's go! If you're new, welcome. My name is Martin Conde, and I usually make videos on the latest hype trends, sneaker news, as well as great alternatives. Now, if you're into those kinds of things, do subscribe to the channel and always be updated. Vans has been around for a pretty long time, since 1966 to be exact. And through those years, they have mastered releasing different classic silhouettes. It all started with brothers Paul and Jim Van Doren along with partners Gordon Lee and Serge Delia who opened the business in Anaheim, California on March 16th. The Van Doren rubber company is unique in that it manufactured shoes on premises and sells them directly to the public. It was in 1976 that the Vans 95, now known as the Era, with a padded collar in different color combinations, which was designed by Tony Alva and Stacy Peralta, became the shoe of choice for a generation of skateboarders. It was also during this time that the Vance Off the Wall logo made its debut. Then the next year, the Vance 98 is also introduced, and with the help of skateboarders and BMX riders, Vance Classic slip ons became the rage in Southern California and will come to be the original slip on silhouette that will be known as an icon for generations. It was it was not until 1982, however, that the Vans Classic slip-ons gained international attention and appeal when they were worn by Sean Penn in the film Fast Times at Bridgemont High. Now based from the rich history and cultural influence, it is safe to say that the Vans slip-ons have established itself as a classic. The renowned pair was the pioneer for the brand's catapult into lifestyle wear, which made sense as its silhouette inspiration came not from extreme sports, but from a humble boat shoe, a product on the line at Van Doren's old company before he started Vans. Initially, the slip-on rocked a boat shoe sole unit but quickly adopted a more skate-appropriate build-out with a heel cap counter and collar padding taken from the era, as well as the waffle sole which in turn created the shoe we know today. The slip-on remains as Steve Van Doren's favorite style with almost every version he owns made customized exclusively for him. There's something noteworthy when the VP of events and promotions at Vans and son of founder Paul Van Doren relishes this much in his own product. Another reason for you to cop a pair is its availability. One thing to love about the classic slip-ons is how easily available they are. May you be shopping at the mall or online, you can certainly cop a pair anywhere. Coming in different variants, you are sure to get the perfect style year-round or simply catch up with the latest trends and collabs. The slip-on is also the most commonly reinterpreted style by other brands, so we can rest easy knowing that our pairs of classic fan slip-ons will not be falling off anytime soon, if at all. Next reason is how established the pair has been when it comes to style. Over the years, the Vans slip-ons has been a staple for most of us growing up, not only for their popularity but also aesthetically. From its availability in multitudes of colors and designs to the simple options which would go well with any outfit. One reason why I love these so much is how easily you can style them, plus slip-ons are always convenient to have in your closet, especially ones that are well recognized as these. Even then, Celine creative director Phoebe Philo began regularly wearing slip-ons and even debuted a Celine version made with python and pony skin, opening the high fashion floodgates to other brands from Saint Laurent to Givenchy to produce similar homages. Proving that the classic Vans slip-ons influence continuously broadens outside of regular lifestyle and skateboarding sneakers. Another great point and most important for some is the comfort and convenience brought by this pair. Vance has mastered the whole laceless design thing 40 years ago and the OG classic lace free silhouette isn't just easy to wear, it's also a solution for common style dilemmas like easily getting through airport security and packing your bag for a vacation where there's no dress code. Best part, they're easy to manage. I have made a separate video on how you may clean your pair of Vance slip-ons. You may check them out on the link above as well as on the description section below. In essence, the slip-ons constitutes three main upper sections, the vamp, the quarter, and the heel counter. All this rests on Vans classic waffle sole until held in place by the skate shoe's synonymous thick rubber foxing. All three parts of the upper offer themselves up for a potential cascade of designs and patterns, with an endless number of different style options that can be customized by anyone. This simple design also 
constitutes did it slip on comfortable feel when it comes to use so if you are someone who is looking for comfort this one is perfect for you Vans offers some of the best structured and well-designed sneakers at affordable prices. This is a huge factor as to why many have been drawn to collecting them aside from the different designs. As for the slip-on specifically, they would usually range between $50 to $80 or around 2,500 to 4,000 pesos for regular price pairs. Great news because some websites will even offer lower prices during the sale seasons. But low price will not mean low quality. I've had mine for two years now and they are still very reliable. I've had a few issues here and there, but mostly because of too much wear. I just can't get enough of them, I guess. But don't get me wrong, other brands do offer slip-ons with far better quality at a higher price range. Again, this would depend on your needs. But Vance has been a staple when it comes to the casual wear. And with the price, getting your own pair would not be a problem. Overall, this has been one of my favorite sneakers. My love started in high school with the checkered print, which I still have now by the way, and then resurrected in my 20s when the white sneaker craze came to life. The Vans slip-ons have always been easy to use and clean, hence my adoration for them. I love the fact that I can easily wear them and maintain without much hassle. I also enjoy bringing these to travels, especially at the airport. Trust me, they do come in handy. Call me lazy, but these are certainly what I need now that I am an adult. I'm sure there may have been times or will be instances in your life that a handy pair of slip-on sneakers will be of great use. If you are in the market for one, then the van slip-ons will certainly feed your needs. So there we go, what did you think? Do you agree to some of my points? Are you already an owner of a great pair of Vans slip-ons? Let me know your thoughts in the comments down below. If you haven't yet, do subscribe to the channel to be updated with the latest hype trends, sneaker news, as well as great alternatives. Once again, this is Martin Sands, and see ya!